is so slung. Holy. Oh, it actually would work. What's up, guys? Welcome back to the channel. Got the Sling King in the house. Mac Boucher here. We've got a one club challenge here, Purcell Farms. We're going to go three holes here. Here's what's going to happen. We're going to flip the tee. Whoever lands on gets to pick the club. And if somebody loses the hole, the loser gets to pick the club for the next hole to try to give themselves a little bit of a leg up. We're going to play 12, 13, 14. Match play. Match play. Okay, yeah, because if I get stuck in the yeah. bunker, we go driver only and we're in the bunker. I don't need that. I don't yeah, want yeah, to get out of hand. Um, you got anything to say to the people before we get going here? No, I think uh, we're, we're pretty kind of even skill level with these things. I, I would say I'm not the only, I'm not very talented. You're the no, talented no, no. one. I'm, I'm just a Joe Schmo, but we're gonna have some fun. I think it's windy yeah. out here. The wind hasn't been up the whole time we've been here, but it's definitely blowing. So Raining it's gonna make things. Yeah, yeah. There's def we're definitely bad on the elements. All right, let's start here. T flip to see who picks the first club. Oh, it's back. I'm gonna go three wood. Oh, no. We're going right into three wood, why not? I will say three wood is the is the least hit club in my entire bag. I might hit it six times a year. I don't have to high tee it, right? No, no, you can do whatever you want. I might pop fly this, we don't know. <laughs> oh, great shot. I was really hoping you hit it bad. The old dummy mark on the top. <laughs> oh, listen, I don't, my three was nice and smooth. It's got no dummy marks, but we might have one after the. Yeah, that's nice. Maybe I should hit this more often, man. That is a peach there. I mean, it's on the left side, but you know what? I don't love that angle. I so was just thinking about that. I'm going to be angle. honest. I took her up the right because we got green side bunker, back left pin. I mean, yeah. you can hit it on the front right there, but I want to make birdie. Oh, you smashed that. I mean, that went far. Oh, uh, like. That, that's like 290. I was going to say, because I hit driver on this hole yesterday, and I was level with that bunker, <laughs> and I smashed driver. Like you said, I have nothing. My best shot is going to end up in the front right of the green. Yeah. And Max over here, absolutely perfect. I mean, that's just a, that's a veteran one club player right now. Yeah. You've got to play the angles. It's important. <laughs> um, I would like to hit this uh, anywhere right. I don't care if it misses the green. I just want somewhere to give me a little bump and run. Oh, that's so good, dude. My that goodness gracious alive. <laughs> All right. I mean, I don't mind that. I don't mind that. <laughs> that is 10 to 12 feet. You know what's great is, is me and Mac took on the Brian Bros challenge only. You guys got to go check out that video. But let us know if you want to see, like, see me and Mac take on some, uh, some, some golfers, some YouTubers, some pros in like these crazy challenges because, you know, we're pretty good at these shots. All right. As Mac said, I kind of really screwed myself with the position here. But Green and right. I mean, he's got a he's got ten feet for birdie, but green and right. Take a really good putt. Yeah. Somehow work left. That's perfect. Yeah, that's literally all I had. I don't mind that. Something left a little bit. I mean, we've hit four shots total, and we've hit two greens and two fairways, so I can't really complain too that's much. Can you? That's that. I mean, I don't want to give away the other video, but. We, uh, we made two really ridiculous birdies in a row to r two ridiculous challenges, so go check that out. Still is anyone's game, because this is, this is three putt territory, especially this is where I, uh, I need to work on this part of my game with a putter in my hand, let alone everything else, so. <laughs> this would be a tough two putt with a putter. Yeah, no, I agree. I got like a little double breaker here. Take her up over the. I could take her up there, I think. Oh, I didn't hit it. No. That is horrible. Absolutely horrible. I mean, I'm gonna be honest with you, I'm not overly confident with this. I'm just gonna try to get it up inside a, a three foot radius. Oh, that's good. Go Set. in. Set. Go in. What a putt. Okay. We're gonna give you that. Thank you. Very nice. All right, well, that means I gotta make this. The only good news is if I do miss, I get to pick the club next hole. So I got that going. Yeah. Oh, that's nice. Got it again. You had it. I think the rain on the greens had just slowed them down a little bit, maybe. You had that in the heart. Great par from back there, three wood only. Great decision, club work there. <laughs> now we're heading into a little bit of a challenging uh, par 414. Yeah, this is a long one. One down on a three hole match. If I lose this match, it's over. So I, this is a big hole. What's your uh, highest iron in your bag? Five. Five iron. All right, we'll go five iron. Okay. Five iron in. Five iron. 
I mean, I don't hit a lot of five irons. If I could have a nine wood, I would probably have a nine wood. <laughs> Downwind. See, I love how you tee everything so high. It just allows me to be a little You're bit. Slink, slink, slink. I'm just gonna de loft it, swing hard. Oh my gosh, it's so good. This guy's impressive. I just don't know. I should have done the math to try to figure out a yardage to hit that too, and I didn't. Oh, that is so slung. Holy. <laughs> Channel my inner oh. back. Oh, dude, those balls are like pretty close to each other too. His slung slung way more than mine did. <laughs> that was unreal, actually. That, that was a tree skimmer. <laughs> <laughs> Nearly. I think it did clip a little leaf or something. I kind of had a little bit of worried there. I was, I was a little worried. I was thinking that thing ain't coming back. <laughs> and then she tossed on the left turn signal and was <laughs> peeling. Well, Mac, our balls are maybe five yards apart and when we both hit, made contact with them, they had to have been at least 200 yards apart. <laughs> yeah, they <laughs> hugged the tree line on both sides of this fairway. All right, we have, I think like 190. Yeah, we. I feel like we have a little too much club because it is downwind. So we're yeah, probably so gonna, gonna have to take to a little a bit cut. off it. Oh, that's so good. Oh my goodness. Gotta go a little bit, I think. Wow. I mean, it doesn't really need to go, <laughs> to go if I'm much. being honest with you. Let's go. Jeez. I have almost the same yardage as uh, Josh did, so I'm going to have to kind of do the same thing. Are you going to try cut. to cut it as well? That's yeah, I'm going to go low. I, I really hope you hit a good one here. Oh, my goodness. Oh, it didn't cut. It's coming. Oh, I think that wind's holding it. Oh, bunker. That's going to be tricky. Uh, I don't really know what to say because I don't love a five iron of a bunker. The thing is, it was coming, and I feel like the wind. See, Gary Player lo like loves that, doesn't he? A little open face four iron of the bunker. I said exactly I didn't want to hit in this greenside bunker because a five iron of a greenside bunker isn't great, but you're in there to 10 feet, so realistically, I'm in trouble anyways. I'm going just full ham five iron into the lip. Hopefully, it pops up and gives me a nice soft rollout. Oh. Okay, so it didn't work, but you know what? <laughs> I had to try it because I, I had a terrible lie. There was no chance of me getting a five iron into that. So I like the effort. You know though. what? Sometimes you just gotta be a little crafty with it. <laughs> you know what, Mac? Let me tap in my birdie. So you know, just you can feel, you just take me out of my misery? You don't feel so bad. Yeah, can you just tap your birdie in, please, please? Oh, it broke. I'll try to hit my flop shot for the tie. Oh, uh, you can make it. You could make it. Oh, not bad though. All right, well, that was ugly. That was ugly, folks. The flop shot was not an option. From where I was sitting, no, I was, was in a rake mark. Too. It was a tight yeah. lie. I would have left it in the bunker, or bladed into these trees. So to, I actually kept it in play, which. See, that's the thing about when that. you're doing like shots like me and Mac do, especially on like the internet, you got to try new stuff because you're trying to be inventive and be creative. Sometimes it doesn't work. Sometimes it will work under certain six, uh, uh, circumstances. Yeah. So. But hey, we're all square, heading into the last hole, which is a par three. The good news is Matt gets to pick. So, um, so far, everyone that's picked the club has won their hole. So let's keep, see if that trend keeps up here. Oh boy, I don't like, I don't like the way this looks. Get your driver, big guy. Is that driver? We're going driver. It's par three, long par three. Um, it is like, I think it's like 2.30. It's 2.30, it's back left pin. I just like hitting driver on a par three. I have a small ego, like I don't. I don't really. This uh, is a, this is, but you messed up because this is a full driver for me. Yeah, full, <laughs> full gas. The main thing, driver only, is just avoid the bunkers. Oh no, go through. Oh no, it caught the clip. Okay, you're in play. Oh, I'm in play. You're in play. You can actually probably miss the bunker left and it's, skirt that up. That gets up a foot. Yeah. It's perfect. No, you. Uh, just caught the top of that left tree. I can actually swing relatively hard at this, which is kind of nice. Oh my goodness gracious. That might be the best shot I've ever seen in my life. Oh, what a bad kick. If that's another foot. Another yard. A, another yard. If that lands on the green, it's, it's next to the hole. You hate to see that. You it is not that. over. I actually deserved a lot better than that. Now, here's the issue. I just, I mean, I hit a good shot. It just caught literally a foot higher. It's probably on the green. It's all wet over here. So, you, you know, you want to run your driver, but this wet grass is going to want to grab it. But if it jumps over it, you hit it too hard, it's gone. So, I'm going to try to make four here. Don't tell Mac, but the nice thing about these clippings is we're playing lift, clean, in place. That. Oh my goodness, how good is that? Oh, oh my gosh, that could be really good. 
How close? Two feet. Two feet. <laughs> You're kidding me. <laughs> I mean, I did use a little bit of clipping tee. So, mine was peeling in. It landed here. That thing needed another, I'll call it two and a half feet, and it would have probably skirted right over there because it had some speed. Now we're left with just an impossible. I have to go up Mount Everest here, down this little gully, up another gully, down to his. I mean, and I have to do it after just witnessing what I just witnessed. Good luck. That. Oh my. Sit. Dude, that is so good. I went like full Tony Hawk ramp off this. Like, <laughs> I think he did a little backflip. A little 900? Uh, a little 900, a little cork nine. How about those two shots? I mean, to be honest, tough par three. I've made bogey or double in this hole with normal yeah. golf shots this yeah. entire week. So thirties. this is a really- All this is telling me is that I think I need to stick to uh, not normal golf. I think That's this is going pretty straight down the hill. The claw looks silly. If I was putting with a normal putter, there was zero chance I'd make this. But with driver, I just have this weird confidence with oh me. Oh my gosh. So. Hey, Mid talk. Are you kidding me? That's the silkiest up and down. Now this sudden makes my little foot and a half or a little bit longer. I think we do the playoff on 17, par three, over water. Ooh. And you have to skip it. I like it. Well, he's talking about playoffs already. I still have to make this putt. I, 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 I've conceded you the par. You, oh, okay. This is that good. shot was too good. I, 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 I know you said we have to finish everything, but a shot deserves to be good. He like he had nothing. Yeah. I would give you a wedge in your hand. There's oh, zero no, chance no, you no, would no, hit it. If I had a wedge, I would hit it to like 30 feet. There's no question. I hope you guys are enjoying this video. If you if you are liking it, hit the like button, smash the subscribe, and go check out Matt's or Max channel. It's linked in the description below. He's making some awesome content as always. So go give him a subscribe as well. We're going to, we might skip a hole, go to the 17th hole, the par three with water. Okay, so we're on the 17th hole. Um, it's my turn to pick again because I tied the last hole. I'm gonna make it a little different because it's a playoff. I think we need to spice it up a little bit. So we got a short little par three. We're gonna play the four deck here. You have to skip it across this pond onto the green. If you miss the pond, it ends up on land, automatic one shot penalty, you keep playing. We're gonna use five iron, so you gotta put, putt and chip with five iron. Um, All right. But yeah, gotta hit water. Sudden death. And we're gonna go like a little bit on the down slope to make it easier, cause. Yeah, but you got those weeds there. Am I yeah, do true. like a weed whacker with the club? Yeah, yeah, we can do some bush work first. I don't think they mind that. All right. Cool. All right. I personally think the hole looks better now. It's more framed. They're weed whacking out here, so I just did them a favor. Okay, two shot penalty if you don't hit the water. Because I don't want you going full flop shot five iron. Yeah, That's not so, fair. So this is Max Max pick. I wouldn't have picked this shot, but because of how close we are, we only have like 80 yards. It's so a really like, challenging shot, but you got a really steep bank there that's wet. I've seen this guy do some stuff before on a golf course. And let's see, let's see what he's got here. I think I just need to hammer it to make sure I get it on dry land. Oh, that's so good. Oh my god. I just gosh, can't get it high. It's just so yeah. hard to get it high from this angle. But I, I have confidence that you're gonna be able to do it. Drop do zones on the left side that's green there, so I'm gonna be shooting three over by the cart path. If I liked I, I should have used the T. If I, I, I was, don't hit water here, it could be two shots. That's so good. Sit. That's so good. Sit, 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 sit. I love that. I tell you what though, I could I could easily dump that one into the water. So this is not over. <laughs> I could it's literally I'm gonna be hitting back downhill with a five iron towards water so i'm dropping oh. right over there shooting three uh i'm in trouble i'm in real trouble this was a challenge that i probably should have thought out more <laughs> okay um so i'm gonna have to drop josh at the back there it's not over yet because i kind of still think that i can uh get this up and down we got a pretty generous drop zone here um i just got a little pitch across the green nothing too crazy so drop it here it's lift clean cheat out here so I can cheat. And my goal here, if I can make a four, I'm in okay shape still, because he's not in a great spot up there. That was terrible. All right, advantage, Josh. This would be a really hard shot with a wedge, I'm not gonna lie. Probably the shot is just bump it into the hill. I mean, but... pressure, you got shots to work with. But I don't think, I don't think that's like cool enough. I'm gonna bring in the water and, and flop it. Oh, that's nice. Set. Set. I mean, that's a lovely shot. Yeah, maybe I just flop with my five iron for now. If I had to hit a wedge there, I would've bladed it into the water, but. This is a must make, and even if I make it, I'm not looking good. So, got a little 
pretty big breaker here, left to right, down the hill. Really need this to drop somehow. Oh, it's right on line. I didn't hit it. I think that was a great line. All right. All right. See if I can make this in the. Knock it in for the three. Was not over though. I would love to see a par. To be honest. Three putter. No, no. Knock it in. Are you kidding me? You That's deserve it. Skipper, one, you one deserve it. Par there. You deserve the par. <laughs> that was unbelievable. I mean, I can't compete with that. No, yes you can. Five. This, this guy is unbelievable. I know it's, I've seen a lot of haters on social media on, on the page a little bit. I get my fair share too. Yeah, I think but I've been with this guy for three days and I've seen some of the most impressive shots I've ever seen in my life. So I hope, I really hope we can get that series going where we we challenge people to, sh to holes like this and challenges like this because so much fun. Yeah, I think I think there's a there's something there for us because yeah. I think it's a good chance for us to actually win. Yeah, yeah exactly. <laughs> thanks for being on the channel, man. I really appreciate it. Thanks so much yeah, for watching, guys. Hope you enjoyed it. See you next time.